Hey, two, Doc, I'm back because I've been dealing with some migraine headaches uh, the last two months. Normally in the afternoons, a little bit after I've had my work day, uh, mm -hmm. I go home and I'm dealing with like migraines. Migraine headaches or headaches in general could be a sign of a lot of things, right? An aneurysm of the brain. You can just be dehydrated. Maybe you had an injury and now it's a sequela from that. My suggestion is we'd obviously draw your blood, see what your panels are, see what your testosterone is, even your electrolytes, all that information. And if that still comes comes back normal, then what we should do is do an MRI. When we do an MRI of the brain, we're gonna be looking at a lot of things that normally just taking a history is not gonna tell. So we're gonna be able to see just the structure of the brain, and then we're gonna be able to see, do you have anything that's going on in like the white matter tracts, which is the area that things like multiple sclerosis can affect. Then we could then look at the vascular structures. Do you have an aneurysm? Is a normal distribution of all the blood to your brain? So there could be a whole different, even something as simple as having part of the structure of your brain going through an opening that it's not supposed to be like a Chiari, what's called the Chiari malformation. You do an MRI, you've been suffering these, for these headaches for a very long time. No one's ever bothered to check and voila, we see congenital defect in your brain that that could be easily taken care of as well. Migraines or headaches in general is just a sign and symptom of other things that could be going on underneath the, the surface. So what's my next step? So we're going to draw your blood today and then we'll, we'll take it from there after we know that everything's checks out then we'll get you in for the MRI. <laughs>